Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to Texas. I'm your lovely host, Galvin. Or should I say, yeehaw! Let's kill uh, the Confederates finally. Worried. Yeah, you should be worried. Liberate New Africa. Nice. Uh, I will look into it, and it's going to cost me 30 plays? Alright. Hmm. Because, uh, I want to conquer. Mississippi and Alabama. The problem is they're likely to back down, even now, which kind of tells me that I'm in a good position. And I should be... You know, preparing for a bit more of an offensive effort. The Ottoman Empire sides with them. Well, that's certainly interesting. Well, in that case, I'm going to force that. Let's see, I'm going to, so, that'd be Georgia, so yeah, let's liberate Georgia to get them in. The problem is that brings them back down to worried. Oh, and then Mexico sides with them too, jeez. That's a problem. I wasn't expecting to be stabbed in the back by Mexico. Yeah, grant of permission, time's of the essence. Alright, the good news is I do have a decent chunk of British soldiers in that. Coming to help. The Mexico Rio Grande front? Good. Because, dear lord, you're going to have to entrench and hold that. We're building ourselves up over here, and it looks like we might actually be able to do it, so... From the ground up. I don't care. Like... All right, that uh, that makes it a lot easier to ban slavery. All right, so yeah, we uh, we've got both fronts covered now. British uh, blunder, but that's all right. Yeah, try and hold it, would ya? We're just gonna have to push. Like Arkansas, Mississippi, Alabama, Georgia. Return Sinai. Yeah, I don't know about that. I don't know, it does look like the Ottomans can't fight worth a damn. To be fair, they're currently in a civil war, so it sucks to be them. But yeah. It looks like I need to uh, adjust where I am at. It looks like the British have this front covered. So I'm going to send my troops down to crush some Mexicans. And hold the line. Because, uh, yeah, it looks like the Confederates just kind of collapsed. Alright. Yeah, I'm not here to fight the Mexicans, but I guess, you know, we should. Gotta teach him a lesson and all that. Shame. I would have loved to take the Rio Grande. I mean, I'm getting strong enough now where at least it's possible. Alright. But yeah, now it's, uh, I think only a matter of time as the Confederate army is kind of collapsed completely. There's Mexicans over here, but what are they gonna do? Alright. Mm. Yep. 
Slavery Band 71. Says Germans are mass migrating. Yeah, I don't really need the slavery for pop growth anymore. Oil discovered in Arabistan. Lucky. Alright, so Mexico's done. By the looks of it, we do have, have control over Sinai, so we just need wherever their capital is. Which is Virginia, so yeah. We just need to conquer Georgia. Which looks like will happen eventually. There we go. That should be the end of it. Alright. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the Confederate last stand in Virginia. They have fallen, though. It is over. Now everyone heads across the sea to the Ottoman Empire. That is highly unnecessary, though. Instead, I'm just going to head into Georgia. All right. But yeah, no, Texas grows. Start the incorporation. Jesus Christ, that's expensive. Alright. Ever increasing influence. Eh, it's fine. Trading pays off. Alright, but yeah, no, we've pushed onwards. Very good. I don't know who we could sway, but... Yeah, I really wish I don't didn't have these troops up. Big regret, should have let them stand down and only raised like these eight. It's alright. This will be over in no time, and then... We'll have an Atlantic port, too. Oh, uh, Texas grows bigger. And we will continue to fight until we are stronger than the United States. We have a higher GDP than they do now. So. I think it's fine. Why is Prussia able to construct inside of us? I'm not sure I really want to know. Oh well. Mm -hmm. Alright. Okay. Georgia fell. Our army stood down. Slavery is about to be banned. Things are going good. Now, on that note, I need like five more government administrations. Let's go. And when we're done there, I would really like to, you know, get a compulsory primary school passed. That'd be good. Okay. Compulsory primary schools up next. Oil rig in Louisiana. Well, we have oil. We have lead. So, I need to finish the T3 techs as quickly as possible, I think. And go for plastics. 
Alright. Good lord. Yeah, integrating these is going to be hard. Might need like up to 20 of these. We do get increasing throughput, which I think helps, so. Alright. But yeah, abolition has been achieved. Thank frig. That, well. Yeah, that would cripple the government. Make over truce to the undecided. So yeah, compulsory primary school will help a lot there. We'll look into this. Functionally, I have no reason not to. Same with Mexico, realistically. Alright. As we continue our growth. Alright, I got 219 bureaucracy. We can start on integrating that one. No, I'm not slowing down. Booming oil industry. Yeah, game combustion engine. That's huge progress. Alright. Yeah, it looks like we'll need all three of those, but that's fine. Mm hmm. Okay. Combustion engine's good. Uh, let's see. Dynamite. And no road carts. There. I'm generating a little bit more money. Yeah, we're definitely paying for a hit here. Railway. Oh shit, I'm still doing the Arts Academy. Yeah, we shouldn't do that. That helps a little bit. Military wages. Good for military buildings. Well, let's maybe dissolve the army. As I am to do. Uh, and the USA is gone dictator. Fair enough. After the repeated humiliations, I don't blame them. Alright. No possible nation formation yet. Alright. But I mean, yeah, it's uh, not looking great for America. Because, like, I'm now sporting potentially upwards of 300 troops. That should be enough to dissuade them, realistically. Should be a keyword. Alright, let's pay down our debt, which we're doing at a pretty solid rate. I'm kind of concerned about our investment pool, though. And really our construction in general. Yeah. Which has not, uh, has not been the fastest. Oh well. Yeah, it'll be good to get, uh... I guess I'll need one more. Government administration. Although Texas has enough tax capacity right now, so... Let's maybe build a uh, government admin building over here. And then with that, education can go all the way to five soon. Alright. Mm-hmm. Yeah, let's 
Let's start pushing. Free trade, free your labor. Yeah. Well, this is certainly a much more interesting election now that the uh, Democratic Party fell apart. Uh, the Liberal Coalition will be far too broad to be functional, unfortunately. Yeah. So we'll see. This might just be what we have. Although, man, is the Free Trade Party growing in a lot of votes. That's eh, fine. Hmm. All right. No major socialist internationalism. By all means. Wow, the trade unionists actually take power. Well, I can always maintain that as a contested government, which is good. Alright. The trade unionists will endorse protected speech, which is probably for the best, honestly. I can pair that with uh, guaranteed liberties. We can pass uh, decent workers' rights. Yeah, Confederate aristocratic revolt. It's, uh, it's a little late, Confederacy. It's over. And no change can happen now. I'm sure you're, like, getting rid of serfdom or... Yeah, there you go. Yeah, I figured. But it's too late now. Yeah, the good news is taxes do continue to climb as I get more, you know, like tax income from the integrated states. The real question is, is proportional taxation still an improvement? Like, very close to. So we'll see. Let's maybe just push through protected speech for now, and we'll see. Reinforced concrete, nice. All that construction I'm not using. All right. Well, let's start using some of it, shall we? Let's grow crystal glass. There we go. Mm -hmm. Got some oil there. We'll need more friggin' lead, but that's fine. Alright. Yeah, we're growing economically pretty decent. I do think I need to push south and take the Rio Grande, though. Like, those dye plantations will be some of the most important things I can get. Because right now I am lacking in two resources. Internally. Dye and rubber. Because, like, you know, I did just manage to secure things like iron, so... At least I think I did. Mm hmm. Uh, let me see. Let's see here, shall we? Should all be on standardized filing, philosophy departments, steam trains. Oh, good. An education investment reached four, and we can push it to five. Aw, oh, yeah. Alright. Yeah, that's not bad. Mm -hmm. On the plus side, as I sell these things off, like, I should get money, but the problem is I'm not going to sell them off to people who will be able to invest in here, so. 
I'm not sure it really matters. Yeah, the bill can pass. It'll be fine. Alright. The industrialists will need to be involved in government in some way. Unfortunately. That's far too discordant. Because, yeah, then I can get the new Colossus, and that's a truly terrifying thing. We need multiculturalism as well. Ah, yes, the French Commune. It could happen here. It really could. And yeah, I wouldn't mind having the uh, trade unions knock down just a little bit. Like, socialism's coming and they're just going to get even stronger. And that worries the crap out of me. Marching against peace. Nah, I'm just fine. A settler terror. Yeah. Alright, did a lot of building. Looks good. Let's keep building. We've got more to get. Yeah. We have 700,000 peasants. None of the, like, arable land buildings, unfortunately, seem to be super good, but oh well. Alright. Yeah. We're pulling in a lot of people. Oil's now been discovered in Arkansas. Nice. I mean, realistically, Arkansas is probably the place I want to put my glassworks, but... Oh well. Yeah, we even get the plus five mappy here. Like, this is where the plastic glass works is gonna go. Five decks, so we're getting closer to that. Alright. The white emerges, or emigres. Yeah. People fleeing communism are welcome here. Alright. We're doing a pretty good job at assimilating, too. So. Alright. Prussia to Texas, the Poles. Alright. Yeah. Nah. In the face of revolution. There's no reason to believe it's credible. Let's just keep calm, everyone. There is no need to panic. Alright. Like, the Reds are not. I'm gonna make it here. We'll be fine. Yankee Dixie, Homeland Dixie, Dixie. 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 Yankee. Yankee. Neither. Neither. Fair enough. Yeah, I'm thinking about, you know, maybe trying to make sure I take all the Dixie homelands after all. Alright, we've got protected speech now. 
We can set for decreased autonomy. Mm hmm. Yeah, that could be a bit of a problem. Suppose we'll see. But on the other hand, I'm also growing far more powerful as time passes, so we'll see. Isn't that right, little uh, Britain? Baton Rouge Advocate. Mm -hmm. Alright. So yeah, Crystal Glass. And ceramics, go. Alright, socialism unlocked. A storm approaches. Alright, that's not too bad. Although, I would say, generally speaking, I need to get something passed to defend against that. Guaranteed Liberties is a solid pick. Actually, it's probably fine, because it does time out in, like, three years. So we can probably pull a fire break. Stay standard of living under expected. Really? Why would that be the case? Well, at least probably some reasons. Uh, on that note... I should really probably go through and reset production methods in the areas I conquered, huh? Except for Texas, because I'm pretty sure that shouldn't be the case. Alright. Let's get some industrial ports. Let's also get fertilizers. Condensing engine pump, dynamite, go. Dye plantations? Oh shit, I can get dyes now. Sweet. Contentious topics. Yeah, no. So yeah, they're the specter of the world. It's not able to take up worth a damn. Alright. So we'll be fine. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, we definitely want to be doing crystal glass. Yeah, there we go. And that helps the local lead price. Dutch from the Netherlands, yeah. Like, Europe is just migrating in mass here now. Which is fine. I don't mind at all. In fact, I'm quite happy with it. Repeating rifles. Yeah, you're doing market squares, public trams. Alright, and open hearth. Yeah. Crystal glass. Luxury furniture isn't really worth it right now, unfortunately. Nope. Okay. Nice. Yeah. Really, I just need to try and get this glassworks off the ground. Which is doable. Ceramics. Nice. Alright. Robert de las Paul. Yeah. Really pushing hard on it. 
North German Federation. Well, that certainly is a federation. It certainly is a federation. Yeah. The fact that uh, Bengal exists, Britain is really struggling. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Change rate scaling from the liberty desire, yeah, knowledge sharing, relative prestige, friendly relations, infamy, yeah, let's start damaging relations, I think. I don't really need them anymore. Like, the British have been super helpful, but I think it's probably about time I walk away from them. Now... That said, military statistics, nice. The Romanians, sure. Russia guarantees the independence of Mexico for whatever goddamn reason. They're allied with the Confederacy. So, like, that negates that at least. Although, part of the problem, of course, being the Confederacy will be a general uh, trick. Yeah, you can see what he wants. Alright. Germany formed the League of Allied States, or the North German Federation did anyway. Yeah, they're really struggling with that. Europe in general, I think, is really struggling with the fact that uh, France went commie. Yeah. I mean, we're slowly managing to deal with the specter that haunts the world. Which is for the best. Alright. So what'd you get last time? 32% of the vote. That's unfortunate. Hmm. The problem is I don't think anyone else besides the industrialists can ever really support open borders. Except maybe the anarchists. Ah yes, ethno-nationalists. It's uh, the opposite of what I want. Can push for universal suffrage, but I feel like that's just not going to help. Try to limit them. Robert LeBlanc. Very well. If you want peace, be prepared for war. Yeah. North German mass migration. Yeah, we'll see. False democracy. It's like the opposite of what I want. Luckily, I don't have to take that event. So I just won't. Hmm. Nice time set for the Liberal Party. Alright. So... sort. That is unacceptable government. Good. Let's get migration controls passed. Yeah. We'll join... Well, you had a chance to join the Liberal Party. Thank Fergie you didn't. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we're 13 months out from Spectre haunting the world, and it's actually going down. Good news. Alright. Yeah. Stare at living seems to be improving. Ah, yes. Mm 
Liberate Texas, you say? I mean, I am, but I guess because I'm not rebellious. Jeez. Yeah, it's about time we try and stop France, I guess. Okay, the Liberal Party disintegrated in a hilarious twist because the petite bourgeois want to fight. I mean, I can take the long way around. What are the odds you can come into government? You can't. So yeah, those are the top three, I guess. North Germans are migrating from the Northern Federation. Yeah, my population is just getting out of control. 35 million up to 23 million. All right. The Grand Glassworks of Arkansas is just about done. All right. Well, we're down to only 22 infamy. Sounds good. I'll progress to study. Yeah, French Low Countries. Good luck. And that's kind of where it's going to come down to. Ah, uh, yes, anarchism. On that note, yeah, there are still no useful uh, people, are there? No one who can get me multiculturalism and the new Colossus. God, I want to conquer New York so badly. Really, if I can conquer New York, it would be so amazing. Oh, geez. 94. I take it, yeah, you guys managed to make it down. Yeah, you're hugely angry. You're basically prepped to revolt. On the edge of it, anyway. The good news is, uh, Spectre that haunts the world times out, and we get Firebreak, which will help a lot. That will help. But yeah, this is kind of like the last hurrah of the uh, industrialists, and I need to make sure they succeed. Mom approaches. God, takes so long due to our unacceptable government. Lead mines in Arkansas built. Red Revolution, yellow headlines. Yeah, we should try and get the situation under control. Wow, we get so many peasants here now. Still not enough, mind you, but... Yeah, the Infernal Machine. Limit his appearances for a little bit. I guess it's not actually the last hurrah either. I also desperately try and pass commercialized agriculture instead of homesteading. Easier said than done, mind you. Ah, yes, a corporatist. Mm hmm. That oh, peace treaty. Procession of provocation.
Oh no. 123. Dangerous hours. Well, uh, that's a problem. I got 54 days. The specter that haunts the world might still pull me out of this, but that's a that's a rough revolution. Okay, where's my fire break? Hmm. Yeah, a triumph for all of Texans. That was not as much as I'd hoped. Friends across the border. Yeah. Okay, and 18.6% progress, so yeah. You get 28% force this through, or else it uh, it's a revolution. Good luck. Fuck, it worked. Damn. Didn't actually expect that. Alright. Let's go. Try and get commercialized agriculture. Because honestly then, the petit bourgeois and the yeoman farmers can be dramatically weaker. And that, with any luck, will save us. At least a little bit. Alright, they're not at 100, and that's what matters. Alright. Good lord. Okay. Shift work and vacuum canning is the last, uh, last ones. Then plastics. Combustion engines. Yeah. Stupid socialism. It's uh, made everyone kind of aggressive. do have a decent number of loyalists. How can I deal with you? Standard living, unfilled political movements, low legitimacy, yeah. We'll see. For now, I've just got to try and get commercialized agriculture through. Ah, uh, yes, you're in fact a full-on communist. Abolish script wages. <laughs> Middle managers will be a thing of the past. Yep. Okay, good shit. I'm also building up a lot of excess. I agree, Donald Maxley should stand down. Uh, so let's keep up the pressure here. Oh shit, I'm at negative 700. When the hell did that happen? Good question, honestly. Doesn't really matter though. We'll just pull it all in. Yeah. I mean, my population's just kind of growing out of control, so <laughs> just allow it to. Uh, 3.5 million peasants. Free assistance. I gotta chill. Just gotta chill. We can slowly move 
commercialized agriculture through, and we'll be all right. In the meantime, though, I think that's probably a good place to call it. Some more oils discovered. Soon I hope to be able to use the oil in a decent amount. Still can't believe... Yeah, that's fine. When you have a hammer... Alright. An agricultural solution. I actually do want that. I promise. I'm going to try to do the last, last hurrah of the industrialists. Before they lose the last of their power. But yeah. 40 million GDP. 25 million people. Yeah, we are, uh, we're catching up. Vulture spawn a carcass. So be it. Now, has diplomacy really changed here? You're a defense pact with the Ottoman Empire. Mm -hmm. I do wonder how much and when and where Britain will be willing to support me. Oh, you're already at war with Russia. So what you're telling me is... Yeah, Russia won't support me. Uh, the Ottoman Empire? Yeah, it's not likely to support them either, so. I think I'm good to do this. Christ, I hope I am. Okay, I probably shouldn't do that right now, but... It's one of those, like, I really should just be uh, calling the episode. Not starting more things. But one more turn syndrome hits sometimes, you know? All right, I can always pull it, call Britain in with an obligation if they're particularly worried. Yeah, Mexico immediately sides with them. Conquer Virginia, North Carolina. Is that it? Ah, the Midwest is a separate region, of course. Very good. All right. Well, in that case, yeah, I'm going to want to reload. So that way I can correctly conquer things. All right, I think it's also a good time for me to call the episode. Thank you everyone for watching. I've been your host, Kelvin, and I'll see you guys next time. Take care, folks. Have a good night.